What's going on traders? It's Mike with Tactical Traders doing some weekend scans today on August the 30th. And right now I am looking at ticker symbol R-I-O-T, Riot. And this is a very familiar ticker to me. I'm actually currently, uh, I have been trading this for probably about the last two weeks. And uh, so what I actually personally did with this, and I'll go over the chart momentarily, I've actually uh, bought shares and now started writing contracts uh, out um, for the past couple weeks to actually just collect some more um, profits basically while I am swing trading this stock. But anyways, back into the chart now. So I do have some drawings already on the chart and this is from a previous analysis, but I'm gonna keep them there because they are still relevant. So right here we have a area of resistance that was broke out about two weeks ago and has came up to hit more resistance uh, right around this uh, $4 area. And yes, the price did pop above this uh, for a couple of days. For the most part, I'm looking at $4 as resistance right now. And the price has pulled back down, retested the old breakout point, the old resistance, and now it's been confirmed as support. And that is a great sign for the bulls. And then the price has also just gone sideways in a more of a consolidating fashion. It's been some really good volume the last couple of days and definitely going to be something to watch because this thing can move fast when it does. So if you're going to be looking to trade this as a bullish trade, which I always recommend because I do not recommend shorting penny stocks. If you're looking to trade this in a bullish way, I can go over a couple possible trade plans that you could uh, implement. And before I go into that, just want to let you know, we are now offering a free 30 day trial to our 24 seven live chat room. And you can find information on that below in the description. Anyway, so back into the chart. So if you want to trade this, there's a couple different ways you can do it. You can do this for more of a swing trading uh, perspective and buy in a speculative buy, meaning the pattern hasn't um, really happened yet, broke out yet. And you could buy down here in the low threes and have a minimal, uh, a, a low risk right below support are roughly about $3. Uh, maybe actually even a little bit lower because you have this 50 SMA coming up that can also act as support. So I'd say an entry around 320 with a stop loss at 290 would be a very, very reasonable trade to me if you're looking to swing trade that. The benefits to that type of style is if you do buy down here near a support buy, uh, you have a lower amount of risk and you can possibly make a little bit more profits on the way up. You could trade this range and so you could actually sell a quarter, a third or half of your position here to lock in some profits and then hopefully let the rest ride out for, uh, for more gains. Or if you're looking for more of a day trade momentum uh, trade, I'd be looking for the $4 area to break with an increase of volume, meaning there is more uh, shares being traded when that actually happens, that break of price happens, and that's gonna be cementing that the bulls have a strong back behind it and a good force to carry this stock up to new highs. Now, what's that area for a break? We could probably look at taking some of the profits roughly around 440, and again, you don't have to take them all. You can just take some, a quarter, a half, whatever you like, and let the rest ride. But that's more for a day trade momentum trade. Anyways, traders, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please like that, hit that like button, and comment below. Share your thoughts with me. Let, tell me what you think about Riot. And we also follow us on SockTwits, Facebook, and Instagram. Thank you very much for watching, traders, and until next time, stay profitable.